Trevor St Mary, Geoxford, Trefford Hundred, Rayleigh, Harwich, East Tilbury, Jaywick, South Ockenden, Cumbia Island, Leon C, Malden, Manning Tree, Perthley, Southend, Dumbo. This year, BBC Essex is 30. We're celebrating with lots of special programmes and big events. Keep listening for more news. In 1986, I grew up in Clapton and it was fantastic. There was Because, and the fact that he bit my ear, I was getting ready to bite his ear back. It just so happened, my corner people were saying, oh man, no. <laughs> mm. <laughs> they knew, they knew what I was getting ready to do, because you know. You would have bit his ear off back. I, yeah, I'm the, I'm the, I was in that mindset to do that because I'm from the ghetto, just like he from the ghetto. Anything somebody do to you, you do it back and you do it worse. Or a simple one finger blood prick, and that would give you some indication of a problem. And that's yeah. what's so frustrating for us as parents that it's unnecessary for children to die because of it, mm. um, where it's just not picked up. Um, because the tests are really easy, and it's just a case of getting the word out there mm. about the symptoms. Simon, it's shocking, isn't it, to hear that a child could go undiagnosed for such a long time? Your, your experience, as Sharon points out, was, was so different from hers because of the age of the child. Uh, absolutely. Um, it, it's one, I, I would be... The three husbands she had, I think it was the last of the three, all three husbands died. The first two were also pub landlords. One was the governor of the Cock in Shaftesbury Avenue. I'm not sure about the other one. I believe she ended up owning all the pubs, says Kaz the Cabby. What an amazing story. So his dad grew up in the Hems. It must have been a bit of a place to grow up in life. Um... I got another email from Simon who says, I remember the dive bar on the corner and the chap on the door who looked about 60, uh, grey slick back hair and absolutely terrifying. Um, I remember my first visit to Chinatown. We walked through a small market down the passageway to Charing Cross Road. <laughs> 